Hi guys, it's Jamie, and um, again, I'm answering some viewer questions, and a lot of them had to do with uh, creating leaf molds, because, um, you know, as we get into winter, it's still fall right now, but um, as we get into winter, the leaves become scarce. So, um, what I'm going to do is show you how I create uh, my leaf molds for more, a little bit more complicated leaves like this one. So, um, some of them that are just, you know, the regular shape like this it's easy you know you just press and then you create a dam around it but this one a little more complicated so what i'm going to do here is first of all get rid of some of these air bubbles actually i'll press here and then there all right so first thing i'm going to do is take the vein side down and roll into the surface and it's nice to leave this part on because it helps you pull it up afterwards. So I'm going to press it and do it again. The next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to cut it out. Um, so let me create a barrier here. Um, and then I'm going to use, I like these little skinny needle tools. They seem to move around the leaves um, much easier. And so I'm just going to create or a cutout. Alright, so now I'm going to take the leaf that I just cut out and I'm going to remove. I don't, I'm not worried about this one. So this one I can deform. I'm more concerned about the outside shape. Uh, this fell off. I'm going to put it back. When I, when I put these, oh, they both fell off. Oh. Alright, well anyway. <laughs> So now I'm just going to put this back on here. And put these guys back in. So what I what you see here now is I've created a stamp, um, the negative, for me to press. And now I'm going to cut this out. And maybe get a little closer. And now I can take one of these um, clay walls and I can press in. So you have to be sure that you really um, get this seam sealed down here before you pour the plaster in. So what I'm going to do here is go around the bottom and make sure that this is all sealed properly. That's what it looks like. So the result is something like this. Um, this is a different leaf type, obviously, but when I press it in, I'm only going to get the leaf. Um, whereas opposed to something like this mold, um, I'm when I actually I don't press this one in. I put the clay on top and then I roll it into the leaf. I take it off and then cut it out. So um, I have gone bigger with this style here. And this is the same as this, where you would press it in. I find it cumbersome, though, for these big, large stamps to press in. So uh, I would much prefer um, this method, where I just lay the clay on top of it and roll it in and take it off and then cut it out, as opposed to pressing it in with something like this. Um, the smaller ones, however, are great for this, for this size. Um, so that's how I do it. I'm not going to get into the pouring the plaster. I covered that in another video. So uh, I hope this helps. And good luck. Have fun out there.